So guys, for the first method, you wanna hit it with search and type in activation settings. Click on it. And then once you're on this, you wanna click on troubleshoot. And now this will come up. Wait for this to load. And then once troubleshooting has completed, if it's able to activate Windows in your device, then it will. If it can't, then it's gonna give you an option to contact support to get help. It might also be saying this because your license is not genuine. So you can also go to the store and then purchase a genuine license. And if you recently changed your hardware on your device, then you wanna go with this option right here. I changed hardware on this device recently. Hopefully one of these options will fix your problem. If they're still not working, then next to change product key, we're gonna click on change. And now this will come up. You just wanna double check if you actually typed in the correct product key. So you're gonna type it in right here and then click on next. Hopefully this will not fix your problem. So you just wanna type in your product key again right here and then click on next. See if that works for you. For the last method, you wanna head over to search and type in CMD. Now you want to run it as administrator and then click on yes. And then once you're on this, you want to type in ipconfig space forward slash flush DNS, click on enter. Now you want to type in netsh space int space ip space reset, click on enter again. And now you want to type in netsh space winsock space reset, click on enter again. And now you just want to restart your computer. Now once you come back on Windows, you want to type in your product key again. Hopefully this will not fix your problem.